Hey everyone, and welcome back to the multi-dimensional journey. It's your host, I'm back, Ayahuasca Car, and thank you so much for being patient with me a while. I've been gone in the Peru of jungles, the jungle of Peru. Um, I'm really excited to be back. I have been integrating and I will keep you up to date with my videos and my experiences that I had in Peru um, as we go along here. But today we are talking about one of my favorite topics um, and it applies to everything we talk about on this channel spirituality wellness psychedelics ayahuasca preparation integration and all of the things that we talk about on this channel and today we're talking about your vagus nerve and the vagus nerve is a very complex and beautiful structure in our body so Take a moment to close your eyes and imagine, you know, an intricate system that is running um, down from your, starting kind of behind your ears, all the way down into your neck, connected to all your organs, running down all the way past your stomach. So this thing is in control of so many things. It's part of our parasympathetic nervous system. It's really part of the autonomic nervous system and it sends signals when we're feeling stressed out or when we're feeling calm and so for example if we're really stressed out the body wants to pump out adrenaline and cortisol and when we're in fear right it's not only you know um changing our perspective on our reality but it's also creating an internal system right and our internal world affects our external world right and how we interact with it so the awesome thing is we now know like through science and practice and you know ancient practices backed up by this western science right that uh we can you know control manage manipulate how awesome this thing um works so i'm really excited to take you through some exercises so please uh, hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date with my videos. I love growing my community, so please, please, please. And I'm always looking to add more value to make your life easier. There's a lot of things I specialize in. And no matter what, though, you know, if, if we have more control of our internal state, there are so many things we can do, right? So today I'm going to take you through, uh, through some exercises, which I'm really excited to share with you. And they're really simple. And so here we go. So we are going to do, we're going to start off with diaphragmatic breathing. And so the main focus here with this breathing is a long exhale and your belly fully expanded. And when you're contracting and blowing out, you're really taking your time to blow out. So we'll do three rounds of this. So all you're gonna do is find a comfortable position. I am sitting on a meditation cushion, but you can sit wherever you like in a chair. You can even do it laying down, totally up to you. So we're gonna take a breath, three seconds in through the nose, nice and deep, and then brief hold at the top and long exhale out through the mouth. five seconds again in through the nose for three brief hold at the top and out through the mouth good one last time deep inhale hold at the top and exhale Now, the most important thing doing these exercises is that you're noticing or you're being mindful of how it's actually changing the way you feel. This is really, really important. This is what we refer to as mind-body connection. So you're actually observing or using your mindfulness skills. And if you don't know what mindfulness is, please check out my other videos. I have lots of videos on mindfulness. Um, to notice what is happening as you are changing the chemistry the experience in your body so give that a try 
those different breaths. Um, and then the next one we're going to go into is alternate nos nostril breathing. So this one is in through the left nostril, out through the right. We're going to do it for three times and then go back around again. Okay. So you want to close the nostril. So in through the left, out through the right. In through the left, out through the right. Good. One last time on this side. And out. Going back the other way. In this time, through the right. Out. Great, you're doing good. And out. One last time. And out. Perfect. Once again, noticing what's happening in the body. Maybe taking a nice little sigh there. Yes, yes, yes. Doing so good. Noticing the chemistry in the body. And now um, the last one I'm going to show you here, although there are many exercises you can do to uh, strengthen your vagus nerve or tone it, is... Um, can call it there's a lot of ways to achieve this whether it's through singing chanting humming but really we're looking to stimulate the diaphragm which a lot of the nerve endings in the vagus nerve are there in the diaphragm so we can like stimulate it just by mm, and humming and all sort of, sorts of that uh thing so but what we're gonna do today is we're gonna do peter levine's vu breath you just take a deep breath in through the nose, and then when you release, you're gonna go And even as you're doing that, you're gonna notice that stimulation in this region. Okay, so we're gonna do that three times deep in through the nose and out with the voo. Once again, noticing what is happening in your body for a brief pause, just kind of taking that all in. And just kind of noticing, very good. Um, and so the most important thing is practice, practice, practice. Like anything else, it's a practice. So the more you do it, I would recommend anywhere from three to four times a week for an actual result of noticing what is happening. And just think of it like, you know, exercising. So this is very relatable to, um, you know, any type of physical exercise, but we're just exercising our internal systems. So give these exercises a shot. And if you want to find a daily routine that works for you, Feel free to check out my video that I just did on creating a daily breathwork practice to combine these types of breaths plus combining music and it'll make it a very uh, incredible, enjoyable daily practice for you. Please check out my upcoming breathwork, breathwork circles down below and links to work with me and so much more. Um, it was awesome. Loved hanging out with you guys and I'll see you guys next time. Please feel free to reach out with any video suggestions that you have, I've always liked seeing you guys leave your comments below, what your experience was, and as always, remember why you came here. Bye guys.